Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Franbo. We are still on the hunt for our little kitty cat, and today I believe we are going to find him because apparently these two girls know, or at least know where he is. Mr. Midnight? Those girls, they took my kitty. I don't like to be selfish, but that is my kitten. I like their blue dress, though. It's this little bundle of wood. Firewood to keep the chimney warm. Poor trees. I wonder if they scream all the time while they're burning. Okay, yeah. Oh. Hmm, why is this part painted black and white? Maybe they didn't have enough to paint everything. Guess everyone has different styles and tastes. Okay, so last time, I believe, we woke up in this little bed. And I, I'm going to make assumptions right now. I believe these two girls believe Fran is some kind of pet because they put her in this little bed with a little bowl and we woke up with a hat with a cat on it so I believe they somehow believe Fran is a pet of some sort a cooker for cooking my mommy told me how to use this I don't like to light matches though it always feels like I could burn my entire face oh ooh a sharp shiny knife you might be useful Dry my little hands. I don't have any soup. I don't need a spoon. Spatula. It sounds like Dracula, but in spa. Mmm, <laughs> yummy cookies in all flavors and colors. Honey bear, you taste fabulous. Flour makes me sneeze, but that's a funny feeling. King Leo's baking soda. This always makes the biggest cupcakes. A pine cone. I don't dare to touch it. Maybe it will attack me. Okay, uh, what about this teapot here? A painting of a teapot with painted tea inside with lemon and honey. Uh, what about the window? I close the window so the cold wind stays out. I open the window so the cold wind comes in. Uh, okay. Can I examine the rest of this bed? I won't lay down in that thing. I should try to get out of here instead. With my kitty, of course, not by myself. Are those eyes? Oh my god, they are. I just noticed. And there's a skull on top of here. Maybe they like to see things, so they need more eyes. I have my pills. So they make me see a lot of... What is that? It's fun to see what people have in their homes. Let me see. Bottles, a milk jar, and dry flowers. Huh, nothing of interest. Well, I hate to do it, but we gotta see what the pills tell me. Oh, 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 ew, um, hello, little baby, what are you doing here? Oh, right, because I'm in a well, I forgot, I entered a well. Nobody loves you, but you're so pretty, I like you. At least you're on the wall, like a picture, so everybody can see you. Oh, I see you're very comfortable there, little baby. Did your mommy drop you? I bet she did it because she was sick, it's not your fault. You seem fresh. Are you still alive? You're a clever little baby. You took your placenta with you. The placenta is like a jetpack of blood and nutrients. What are these steps? Ugh. I can't get there from here. I need a bridge. You need a bridge? Do I have anything I could use as a bridge? What about a knife? No, what if I make it... Okay. Um, so that was weird. I guess I need to look for a bridge. I won't sit down. Uh, oh, that's a lot of stuff. The bag smells funny. I'm not gonna touch it. I don't like beans that much. Salt, a very good ingredient. This smells like a weed we had in our garden. What an odd little thing. It looks like a seed. I wonder who Mush is, because he owns all the mushrooms. <laughs> okay. What a pretty can. I won't take somebody else's food. Not all of it, anyways. Pepper. Always good for seasoning the soup. If there's garlic, there are no vampires. Kitties like to play with olives. I guess he thinks they're insects. Squirrels' body parts? I don't want to know. So, I'm assuming we have to cook something? What is with all this creaking? I have matches to light up the darkness. Or just for fun. Okay, so we can use that to light the stove, I think. They don't smell. They must have plastic flowers, then. 
Uh, oh, a dancing teddy. It doesn't have shoes, but it does have a tie. That makes Teddy happy. What is with all this thumping and creaking stuff? The window's locked. Great. Uh, can I look through here? Or... Oh, I can go through here. Is it... Do... Hi. Their faces look familiar, but I'm not sure. Could it be? Um, could it be what? A tiny house in the middle of nowhere. A walk on the beach wouldn't take too long. It looks like somebody lives there. They have a chimney. That was a mysterious woman. I like the blue rose. I never saw a rose in the ocean. Maybe it's an old story. Maybe the moon gave her the rose because he loves her. This isn't my cup. The teapot has no tea at all. Delicious and beautiful. My mouth is watering. I'm so hungry, nobody will notice if one cupcake is missing. Mmm, <laughs> caramel sauce all over it. That cake looks absolutely yummy. I could eat the whole thing. Sweet candy. Chocolate cake, my favorite. Should I? Maybe just a little. Mmm, delicious. Cozy and warm. It, I could burn things here that I don't need. But you never know when you'll need some things. I really hate all this creaking. Now I understand what the deer wanted back in the hospital. Oh, right, the headless deer with a, with a clown face, I guess. It didn't want to get its head fixed. I wanted its head on the wall. Silly me. Oh, it wanted its head on the wall. Firewood in line to be burnt. Uh, can I examine the chandelier? What about these paintings? Is that a flying pig? I wonder if any friendly animal would like to fly with us. That would be a new experience. Not that I don't have any. Can I examine this painting? Okay. Uh, I'm going to go check what happens if I light the oven first. It's quite windy in here. The match won't stay lit. Okay. Fire. Uh, now what? I don't have anything else. Maybe I look for, like, a pot or something? I guess I have to go upstairs, but that's where all the creaking is happening. The sisters, they look alike. Pink and blue, complete opposites. The si oh. A red rose and a painting, huh? A monster who likes goats. The goat looks angry. I guess he's ticklish or annoyed. A broom to fly away or just to clean up. Could I use this as a bridge? I don't know. Oh, wait, hold on. Did I check in here? The drawer opened. Let me see what's inside. Black candles to light up the darkness. Nope. Okay. Wait, hold on. There was a... Ooh, hold on. There was a chain... Ah! That actually scared me. Oh. Oh, a ladder. Perhaps Mr. Midnight is up here. Oh, that ghost scared me. <laughs> oh, God. What's in here? Oh, a lot of stuff. This looks like a very old painting. A mommy holding two babies. I wonder. White candles everywhere. There's a big... Uh, why, what is with this game and dead babies? Hello, doll. Who caught you? I hope that never happens to me. I guess it doesn't need to happen if I'm clever enough. Ugh, these toys are so ugly. I hope they didn't hear me. I don't want them trying to catch me and kill me. Hmm, the perfume smells like teenagers. Tweezers to, to pick up things that my little hands can. Nice stuff. Very, very girly. I guess I'll be very girly when I grow up. I'll lay down and sleep tight when I get back home. And Grace has for sure put on some fresh sheets. I love the feeling of my sleepy head on a clean pillow. Ah, water all around? Water makes me feel helpless. And because I can't swim, I'll have to navigate or something. Kitty is really afraid of water too. Ugh, it's that monster. It's so much blood. I guess I'm not the only one who can see him then. Is he holding a head? I have to be careful. A mirror. 
but why isn't my reflection there? Hello? Huh? This mirror isn't doing its job. It has a little keyhole. Maybe it's just a cork. Oh, up there. Uh, what if I use my tweezers? No? Okay. Uh, any ghosts still? No. What about the attic? Oh. Oh. Mr. Midnight, are you here, kitty? Meow. Oh my goodness, it's you. My beloved friend, I found you. Friend, is that really you? Oh dear, finally. It's me. Come closer, please. Let me see you. Oh, it's him. I didn't think we'd actually find him. I was I, I lied in the intro. I didn't think we'd find him. Oh, friend, I'm so happy to see you. I missed you very much. I had dreams about you. I should probably give him a voice. And he... And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. <laughs> I love you too, Mr. Midnight, and I really miss you. Oh, dear Fran, how did you find this place? After those people took you away into the woods, I tried to follow them. But after a while, I got lost. My senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Somebody took me and put me in this cage. Oh, my dear, I'll open this cage. We need to get to Aunt Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish this was all just a bad dream. Everything's going to be fine. We just have to get out of here. Fran, can I ask you something? Sure, Mr. Midnight. What is it? Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine and find you. What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. Really? What kind of presence? From what it felt, it wasn't human, but it was really peaceful and kind. That's the real magic. It's great to have somebody else taking care of us. Fran, did you hear that? Did you? Oh, I'll see what it is. I'll try and find the key to free you, alright? I love you. Oh, what a pretty doll. I like the hairstyle. Why are you sitting here? There are lots of dolls to play with. But I wouldn't play with any of them. They look scary. A bunny doll. Are you waiting for Easter? Do you lay eggs or do you steal them from a chicken? And how do eggs become chocolate eggs? This fox is still bleeding, I just noticed. Foxy? Oh no, I wish I could take you out of there. What's their problem? Poor foxy fox. I hope someday I find a fox that isn't dead so I can talk to it. Oh. Oh, let's see this. The sisters. But if they're sisters, why are they so old? They have the same jacket that I had in the hospital. Just one hat. Scorpion. Scorpions make me nervous. They walk with their butt in the air ready to stab you. Maybe it's a Zodiac thing. I'm a Sagittarius. Good to know. Ugh! Oh, 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 gee, oh my god. What the hell was that? Oh, my, my, oh, I'm getting, ugh. Oh, that, ugh. I don't know, I don't know what that just did to me, but, oh, God, I feel awful right now. What did you just say? Toys in the attic always carry sadness within them. Uh-huh. I like my own dress, but those are pretty too. My whole body is itchy right now for some reason just because I saw that. Ugh. It's a big umbrella. Well, I'm afraid to do it, but Pels. I'm just back in the well. Does everything just put me back in the well? Um, it looks stable. Let's try. Ah! Huh, bad piece of broom. Bad. Well, I don't know what to do now. Can I plant the seed in here? No? Okay, let's just get... Let's just go! Oh, you scared me. I thought nobody was living here. There you are. We were waiting for you. 
Where's your head? My head? My head is in just the right place. It's you, the precious being from the other world, who would ever believe us. I'm very confused right now, ladies. What are you talking about? Franbo. That's your name, right? And your mom and dad died tragically. It was very brutal, right? <laughs> She's helping her drink? Okay. And now you really want to know who killed them, right? Slow down. How do you know all this? We simply have to know. We are part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us, all the time. I wish I was at home with Mommy and Daddy now. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. I should do that, but Mommy and Daddy will never come back. Drink some tea and eat some cake. It will make you feel better. Thank you, but I really need to know. Who told you these things about me? Are you scared, little friend? I'm confused. Of course not. I'm just curious, that's all. Mostly I'm confused. Where has all this creaking come from? You're sitting right here. I haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. That's very odd for a girl who loves her cat more than anything else in the world. Yet you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? Um, uh, I love him, and that's why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. Do you want him back? Yes, please. I really want to have him back. He's my best friend. Before we set him free, tell us how you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place. A very ugly place. They opened the heads of children to find out what's wrong with them. I was also in the woods, but now here I am looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you, Fran? I'm 10 years old, but I'm going to turn 11 soon. And you? We're 16 years old, much older than you, so you have to obey us. I don't want to obey you. You can't tell me what to do. You haven't even asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around someone's house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all. A stupid little girl who doesn't know how to get home. A stupid little girl who lost her cat. A stupid little girl who takes pills all the time. Stop that, please. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as we say, you and your cat will die. Do you understand? Um, yes, ladies, I'll do whatever you need. Good. Now listen to us carefully. We need you to perform magic spell on us. Do you like magic? Magic is magical. <laughs> Who doesn't like magic? Anyway, this magic is very powerful and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be, pa be careful and precise. Otherwise, terrible things can happen. Ooh. Lost in darkness, lost in tears, your body becomes a lie through the hand of one angel that decides to bring you to sorrow. Summon the old lost body. Is this to summon mom and dad? You will need the heart of a frog, the head of a young virgin, <laughs> um, hair and blood from a black cat, oh, a pentagram made of ashes, the burnt body of a fox. This must be cooked all together inside a pot or cauldron with plenty of water. When you are about to drink the potion, repeat these words. Manam by kanskit o manai er bose erbum esh eberman kanskane erbori foren foren. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. Do it yourself. We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. But why are you like this now? One night, a long time ago, something appeared before us. We thought it was an angel, but it wasn't. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back. But we'll do that later, when we're no longer attached to each other. And show him that he is powerless and he will regret it. That sounds terrible. I'll try my best to help you. We're going to gather some things things you'll need for the ritual. In the meantime, you can go talk to your cat. But we won't set him free yet. Don't even try to open the cage. If you help us, we will help him. Thank you. I'll go talk to him. And Fran, do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you? You silly, silly, stupid little girl. Ha ha ha. Guess I'm gonna go talk to Midnight now. Go on, Fran. Please get me out of this cage. Find the key. Uh. You wanna take a look at this? It 
told me to talk to my cat. Oh, do I take the... What did it say I need? <laughs> the burnt body of a fox. Do you have the rest of the fox anywhere, by chance? Ah! It's him again, but I haven't taken my pills. Well, he opened the window. Thank you, but who is he? Oh. Hey, you. Yes, who's speaking? Me. I'm a toad. I have something to tell you. Yes, what is it? You are in great danger. Don't trust the girls. Why do you say that? Look, girl, I'm a toad. I know I can swim away from this place, but they won't let me. Every time I try to get out of here, I magically return. This house is like a huge magnet. A toad, a cat, magnet. They love us, but not to give us love. They're just to use us. Don't trust them. That's terrible. That's why my kitty is here, then. They gave you a recipe for some kind of magic, right? <laughs> How did you know that? Did you see the dead girl in one of the rooms? <laughs> Well, that could be you, if you try to do it. Uh, she tried, but she did it wrong. <laughs> She's dead. Oh my goodness, I'll think of something else then. I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I would be creative. Huh, creative. I'll try my best. And girl, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. <laughs> I have a wife and kids. I haven't seen them in years. What did I need to get from you? The heart of a frog. Okay, well, goodbye. Well... Did you find a solution already? <laughs> I don't know what to do. I'm mentally stuck. I know you have something that lets you see other things. Oh, right. Forgot about the pills. <laughs> but don't they... I, they just sent me to the well. Unless they don't work out here. I'm a talking toad. Is that, n that normal? I don't think so. <laughs> but you can talk to me. That makes you special. It's logical. Yes, you're right. But what about the things I can see, then? Have you seen everything? Maybe you're missing some messages. I'll see what I can find. Okay, uh, let's see how the pills work out here. Oh. My sister's trying to catch me, but I ran away. I'm scared. Would you help me? I have a monster inside my head. Doubters? I guess some people believe you when it's written down. But what does it mean? Who wrote this? I have papers, yes, but what truth? Doubters need the truth on paper. A rusty old bicycle in the middle of an island. I don't think it would take me very far. There's nothing but water around this house. A big, big rock. I'll leave it there. What do you need? Tweezers? Uh, some pepper and salt? How about I light you on fire? Or how about I show you my certified bug certificate? No, how about I just kill you? Oh, okay. Uh, what else am I missing? That's still on fire. Can I grab- Oh, I forgot I could- Can I grab that? Yes, I can! I don't know why I didn't do that before. Now, can I turn this on? And then fill it with water. And then, put that on the stove. Okay, uh, what did it say I needed again? I keep forgetting. Oh. Heart of a frog, heart of a young virgin, hair and blood from a black cat, a pentagram made of ashes, the burnt body of a fox. Pentagram made of ashes. Oh, a long woody plank. I could do something with it. Oh, that can get me to the other side, right? Let's try this piece of wood. I can't lift it, it's too heavy for me. Use the knife. There we go. Ah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the same. Oh! Toad. Oh, Toad's dead. Ah, that burned. Why? There's no fire. It burned? I can't touch the bottle, it really burns. Maybe it's bewitched so nobody touches it. 
What should I do now? I'm so curious. Um, use the tweezers to grab it. Oh, I got the paper. This is so exciting. What does it say? Revealing the true scroll. The world hides the truth from you. Work your soul through life and you will understand the purpose of this act. If you try to corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden and never see the face of truth. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need blood from the executor of the ritual, ashes to form a pentagram, a blue-bloomed midnight rose, a hair from the person you want to bewitch. Draw a pentagram with the ashes inside the black and white square. Put a lightly put a lighted black candle on each point of the pentagram. Fill a cauldron with water and put the other elements in it. Boil. Pour over the person you want to be witch and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. Bonte Erkam or Ebregham Ol Eber Nam Erber Albin Arkan Erkan Over Arge Began Erfin Oman Demon Eber Echos Etis Abu Elobethid Aw. Okay, but didn't I need like something with a frog? The heart of a frog. The frog died. It's not good to eat bottles. But I need its heart. I don't know. Okay. Let's do this uh, pentagram thing. Oh, wait. I need ashes. Where do I get ashes? Does baking soda work? No, no, don't, don't, don't. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to use this. Ashes to form a pentagram. It just says ashes. Wait, hold on. I, I noticed something over here where there were like a bunch of... I can turn this off. There were like, um... Yeah. A vase to put some flowers in. It has ashes inside. Okay, yeah, so I can use this. Wow, this worked out great. Very nicely done, Fran. And now we use the candles. Now we use the matches. Um, do I still need to do this, though? Let me see. Blood from the Executor of the Ritual. Do I have to cut myself? Oh! Ouch, that hurt, but now I have some blood. Okay. Sure. I'm not sure what to do with this. Oh, it, I did actually have to cut myself, huh? Well, now this is bloody. A blue-bloomed night moonlight rose. Blue-bloomed blue night rose. I'm assuming that's from the full... From the seed I have. Where can I play it? Where can I plant it though? Wait. Wait, the base is empty. Oh, I don't have the base anymore. Never mind. Well, what about this vase here? Where can I grow this? Oh, wait, hold on. Oh. I never went over here. I kind of wish I had, and now that I've seen this. Oh my goodness, the smell. Poor girl, who could have done this and why? I need to be careful and protect myself and my kitty. How did I not see that? How? Oh, I should not be playing this game if I'm going to be this stupid. Hi. Hello? Who are you? Can't you hear me? I'm Fran. Uh, oh, you're just going to walk away. Oh, a record player. I wonder if it works. Let's see. Oh, there it works. Maybe I should keep it down. It's a lot of wind coming out of there. Wow, I can't see anything but water. Where is this place? I hope Mr. Midnight knows how to get out of here. Oh, a typewriter. And it works. I guess I could write something, but there isn't any paper. And a good writer has to know what they want to write about. There are many books and things on the shelf. So many that it makes me dizzy. Is this an owl? I'll just leave them here. Owls and cats are a bit alike. Both are curious. Both like to kill mice. I keep hearing footsteps. 
and both are good companions of witches. The stairs end in a wall. Maybe that was the door I made, and now it's disappeared. Ah, uh, I have to find another way out. That makes no sense. Why am I outside? I went inside a well. Well, I guess I took the pills and it put me inside a well, but still. Okay, so what do I need here? Ooh. Jants. <laughs> huh? Wait a minute. Is that the big ant from the woods? It could be him, only a bit younger. Jants. I think I saw this name earlier. Is this important at all? No. Okay. Oh, wait. I grow the rose in the ocean. That's how I was supposed to... Oh, my God. A nice blue rose. Yeah, how... Ugh. I gotta pay more attention to this. My God. Okay. Uh, so now I put this in the pot, right? Goodbye, blue rose. Into the pot now. And now I need to... Hair from the person you want to be witch. Who exactly do I want to be witch again? Is it the... Is it the girls? The, the, the twins that I want to bewitch? I think it is. Okay, I forgot to record. Um, apparently I put the paper in the typewriter and now I'm typing something. Hair from your head. Oh, is this to convince the twins? Well, that would be good if I knew where they are. Oh, hi. Fran, here are the materials you'll need. Have you studied the ritual? Yes, but I need more time. I can't remember all the words. Well, learn them fast. Let us know when you're ready. Ah, uh, hey, I need your hair. Oh. Psst. Girl, I think you're gonna need help get- I think you need help getting rid of that bag. I can do that for you. But I may need it. No, you don't. Trust me. If we want to get out of here, that bag must disappear. <laughs> I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. Okay. Hey, I need your hair. We're waiting for you, friend. Look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. Hair, you say? No hair is needed. We know that. But look for yourself. It's written down there in the recipe. That's true. How could we miss that? All right. Uh -huh. There, now get prepared. I'll let you know when I'm ready. All right, so now I can put that in here. Now the hair. Good. Ah! Oh, that scared me. I should show the girls that the potion is ready. Oh. Everything is ready. Let's go to the kitchen. Good. Let's go. Please sit down and close your eyes, ladies. And now I'll say the words. Wait a second. That isn't the right spell. You tricked us. What the hell is that? Oh my god. What have I done? Oh my goodness, this isn't right. The key! Now I can free my dead kitty. I'm nervous. What did I just do? <laughs> I thought I was, like, separating them or something. Ugh. I killed them both. Well, that's good. They made me do all these errands for them. Uh, let me let you out. What is it, friend? Open the cage. I can't. The key doesn't fit. Did you see another keyhole somewhere? 
Yes, I saw one. I'll see if it fits there. I'll be waiting. Hurry up. Yeah, there was one above the mirror, I believe. The key was for this keyhole. And what's that, a puzzle? Oh my god, what? A mechanical thing. It rotates. It may be some sort of engine. Uh, okay. This must be part of the machine. I can't move it. What can I move? This one can't be moved. I guess I have to open this thing, but how? Oh. I can move these around. Now that's spinning. Uh, that doesn't work. Um, what about the big cog? Okay, now that's all spinning. I think I got it. And then I just gotta move this. To here. Oh, no. Um. Oh, did I mess up? Oh, no, I got it. There we go. Oh, hi. Ooh. Don't like that at all. Oh my god. Who's who's Edward? Hold on, hold on. There was a there was a writing in the wall. It was Edward. Um Sister promise we Clara Mia Buhal met. Promise to revenge the unfair destiny it were decided for us. With blood and tears, we promise that we will kill him and bring our bodies back. We won't stand this any longer. Even though we are sisters, we hate each other and we'll, we, we will always hate each other. Nothing will ever change that. But now, with our bodies attached to each other, we can't complete our task. The strongest will live forever and the weakest will die. So, it were is some kind of demon, I guess? Maybe... I don't know. That's a blue rosette. I like it very much. Mother must die. Ew. My mommy was very good. She hugged me many times. Maybe that mommy wasn't good at mommy at all. Oh dear, this must be the key to the cage, finally. Duotine. My pills are called Duotine too. Hmm, but they got the yellow ones. I wonder what the difference is. Oh, a two-headed doll. It must be really old. It's also quite dirty. I guess they played with this a lot. My toys are also a bit dirty. I miss playing with my dollhouse. Oh, the sisters have a huge scar in the middle. That's scary. Maybe they were two different people after all. Huh, the bed and floor look so familiar. I think that's the hospital or mental hospital or orphanage or whatever it was we were in. What's this? Two skeletons? They look kind of small, like me. I can imagine who these two... I can't imagine who these two were. Then I'm not a killer. What? Oh, were those the twins I killed? They were the skeletons? They were already dead? Were their spirits haunting this place or something? Nope. Oh, right. Sorry. Key. I think this is the key. It worked. My dear kitty, it worked. Come out. Let me hug you. You're real, right? Okay, good. Yay. Oh, this feels good. I'm free, fan, my good friend. You're free, my dear. Now it's time to go home. Yes, let's go. Uh, how do I get out? <laughs> we need to go home, kitty. I hope the way back home isn't far. I hope so too, friend. We can do this together. I hope. I did it, Sir Toad. The girls are gone. That's perfect. Now I can leave this place and return to my family. I want to do that too, sir. I finally found my kitty. I just want to go home now and be with Aunt Grace. But how will you get out of here? There's no boat. 
I thought you could help us get out of here. I would love to help you, but I'm too tiny. Also, I'm too stupid to help you out. <laughs> Even though my body is quite malleable, I would be possible to carry you both out to the other side. Let me think about it. Don't leave us yet, please. What do you look like with the pills? You just disappear? Okay. There was still that door that I entered through. Do I have anything that could help? Baking soda? I don't know if that's gonna help. So, he's supposed to help us and so am I supposed to like size him up? Will this frog be able to help? And do I need to make him bigger somehow? Oh, wait, hold on. I didn't talk to that girl yet. I, I saved her. Nope, you still don't like it? Okay, you're still sad. Take this, Toad. It may help. I'm not a bakery bun, but you're all slimy and soft like dough. You're right, it may work. Here goes. What the? What? It worked. It really did. I'm so big and I feel so gorgeous. Great. Let's go. Come, Mr. Midnight. Sure, friend. I only have one complaint. That giant toad is staring at me. What are you talking about? He wants to help us. I forgot. I forgot I have to do his voice. All right. If he tries anything, I'll scratch him. That's okay, but try not to hurt him too much while we're sitting on him. The water is deep and we don't know what kind of creatures are in there. If we fall in the water, we could die, Kitty. Oh, I promise I won't scratch the toad. Let's go. Hey, girl. Before we go, I forgot to give you something. I saw you in this picture, so I thought it was yours. <laughs> I found it in the sewer. And this book was with it, too. <laughs> oh, toad, you found my family photo. Thank you very much. I thought I had lost it forever, but the book isn't mine. Oh, well, take the book as a gift. It's always healthy to read. It has many pictures. <laughs> I can't read, so I don't have any use for it. <laughs> wow, thank you. I like pictures. Well, let's go now. Yes, here we go. Hold on tight. <laughs> what? Oh, it's Frogger. Oh. No. Uh, come on. <laughs> Don't, don't, okay, um, guess I just wait until something else, come on, there we go, ba -bow. here we are, jump off me now, get, get off me, let's go kitty, let's go kitty, sorry, wrong voice. Well, well, now it's time to go home, I haven't seen my wife in a while. I hope you find your family soon, Sir Toad. Thank you. You too. Farewell. Goodbye, sir, and thank you for the ride. Goodbye, sir, and thank you for the ride. Wrong voice again. <laughs> Fran, what should we do now? Find the way back home, Kitty. Do you see the sky? It's dawn, and really soon all the scary things will disappear. Ah, I'm so hungry and sleepy. I want to go home now. Me too, Kitty. We'll find the way. I'll do my best to help you, my dear. Let's go. 
Well, that's where I'm leaving it off. We found our cat, and we met a giant toad who's gonna go back to his wife and kids. Uh, and we killed someone. I think we did good today. Well, um, I don't know what to expect now. I mean, I guess some, some bad things are gonna happen on the way home. Sorry about that, my recording cut off. Anyways, yeah, um, so that's where I'm leaving it off. I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye.